You guys were in the streets? Oh, yeah. Dabbled. I was in the 101, the 405. Ooh, this guy might have been in the hiking trails. I don't even know if these were paved. I mean, he they was off road. He was going to underdeveloped roads. Yes. Yeah, it wasn't great. Josh Richards is here today. You have a hey. cast on. You also just said you have an post apocalyptic dirt bike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, me and a couple of my buddies, we started going on these camping trips and, you know, Great. guys around the fire guys drinking some guys. beer. We started yeah. talking about the apocalypse. Have to. Have yeah. to. Um, and we started developing a plan. So, first step, we all needed to get dirt bikes. Okay. We thought, you know, we're in LA, roads are getting blocked up, right? Yeah. Yes. It's going to be terrible. Also, with the dirt bike, you know, you're getting good gas mileage. You are. I can are go you? and siphon. I don't know. I think so. I think you are. I, I'm I going bird you're... scooter if there's an... Actually, that's a terrible no, idea. No, terrible. Electric the, 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 the grid's gone. Gone. Yeah, <laughs> the grid's over. Hey, this come guy, on, guys. Guy you're dead so long. Minutes, no, I'm not. looking for the environment of, of, of the global sphere here, you know? There is no environment. Zombies yeah. eating everybody. It's, it's, a, over. it's over. It's yeah, over. It's crazy to die on a bird scooter. Like, if, if zombies are chasing you on a bird scooter, you're topping out 17 miles an hour. Oh, it's over. Alright, so let me listen to a smart man over here. So yeah, we're yeah. going dirt bike. We're going dirt bike. You know, Yamaha. you can siphon easily. Go cut your garden hose in your backyard. Siphon, you siphon the cars that are all like blocking the road, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah you don't and then strike we me also... as a siphon guy. I like this side of you. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm, a, I'm a big siphon guy. Hell I love yeah, sucking hell on some hose. Hell dude, yeah. Yeah, you can start only fans quickly with just People were telling me you're a big siphon guy. I didn't believe it. Really? I've I've actually started to hear those rumors go around LA a bit. Yeah, that I'm a siphon guy. Is that how you broke the hand? Yeah. Tough. Yeah, yeah, That's tough. yeah, yeah. The yeah, yeah, siphon yeah, yeah. suck down is what oh, they dude. call Josh. When you school. when you start to like, because I'm I'm a I'm a single single hand siphoner, okay. right? So Ooh. I usually only use one hand. For oh the wow, siphon. what are you doing with that other hand? Well, usually it's doing whatever it needs to do. You texting. know what I'm well, what saying? Texting, texting. Okay. You don't want to double siphon? <laughs> no, I'm not fucking I'm make not that big a thumbnail. Into the double, but I tried it. Yeah, you know, I had a little bit of a longer garden hose. Nice. I had to go for the double hand siphon, and it was just too much. Broke, double broke the hand. It's tough, man. That's tough. Dirt bike. Dirt, Dirt bike. bike Siphoning. Where you? Are you, have a, you have a backpack full of stuff. Um, you know, you got your like regular things in a backpack. I think just like certain knives or like food that's gonna last. Like non perishable. Knives you know in a saying? backpack are so funny. You're like, where's my iPhone charge? And just dice Cut. up your hand. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe have it in like a specific pocket. In a, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah knife yeah, yeah. pocket. Or like a, you can like get you the little ones that like put it. them on the belt. A sheath. A sheet. A shield? A sheath? 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 Is where you hold the knife in? Isn't that an yeah. underwear? <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. I think, too, that's, I think that's what it's called. Not Ned. Yeah. Fuck him. <laughs> Not Ned. <laughs> um, you put your cock in the sheath. Now it all makes sense. What? The underwear oh, is called oh, sheath oh, and your cock oh. is the sword. Is the knife. Yes. I Okay. Dagger for me. Not hold Ned. On. Backpacks, sit around fireplace, <laughs> guns blazing. You're oh, not yeah. talking about women. You're in love, so there's no need to no, talk no, about no. women. No, no, no. I have a, I have a girlfriend. I am so in love with. This is all about right. hose yeah. and garden, oh, but not garden, 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 garden hose. Okay, for yeah. siphoning. Siphon. Yes. Berry gas every like you know few miles. We got we got like five berry different gas? checkpoints. Did you say berry gas. That's such yeah. A, that'd be a great name. We're gonna bury gasoline berry so gas. that oh, we yeah. have. Yes, checkpoints that we're gonna go and have this. You're gonna make it. We have a we have a hideout. In like uh, Yosemite, so we have like this kind of That's like my bunker. Name. Really, <laughs> she's got a big bunker, dog. Yeah, hell yeah! Hey, oh, I'm, sorry. My daughter, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That's too far. She doesn't have a daughter. It's all <laughs> good. Daughter, We're yeah. in land. <laughs> Yosemite gas. Yeah, Yosemite bear gas, and then you know we got a nice little bunker. Barry mm -hmm. Gas sounds like the worst agent ever. It does sound like Bear a shitty a, town manager. Barry Gas. It's a Bear commercial gas. rep, for sure. <laughs> yeah. He does commercials, yeah. He's from Pop got, Tarts, that's yeah, it. Yeah, like, I got you for a Petco commercial. Like, I'm a human. <laughs> <laughs> Give that Bart, to a shut cat. Up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but that's kind of the, that's, that's where the plan ends. Do you have a, you have a gun? Solar panels, you know. Gun? Uh, I'm Canadian, so I can't get a gun so easy out here in the States. You can get a gun pretty easy out here. Not yeah. in L.A. <laughs> yeah, whoa, in whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> what part of L.A. are you talking? Yeah. I guess you go to tours, true. you ask an owl, and they'll hand you a yeah. fucking gun. I meant, gun. like, legally. Go anywhere oh, near yeah, SoFi yeah, yeah, Stadium. Yeah, yeah. You'll be strapped. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. I, I was trying Any to go down, Oakland like, the legal Raiders route. Fan, but dude, just ah. ask them. Yeah. Uh, okay, hold on. Is that... I never even thought about that. You guys can't get guns eat, but you can get guns. It's just not... It's not it, in Canada. I can get guns. Just it's so funny guns? to be strapped up in Canada. I think there's just like a lot <laughs> stricter rules <laughs> about <laughs> going and getting a gun, not being from the United States. Yeah, there's, that's a big you, thing. Let me yeah. ask you this: Do it's just not because that's how they keep it. The school, like uh, that's how they keep the shootings down in the states. Is because not giving it no to Canada them. people because they would be like sorry, sorry, mm. sorry, sorry, and it'd be a whole yeah, thing. Oh, uh, <laughs> I see. Um, what am I yeah. saying? Oh, do do Canadian police do they have guns? This, I'm not even trying. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, just, uh, I, I don't know. What? No, no. London. What do you think these finger guns? <laughs> Get out! But like, no, UK, but UK, cops UK, no guns? cops don't have guns. Australian cops don't have guns. No, they have like 
And tasers, right? I think yeah. that's it. So they, they spent all those money on those silly little goofy hats, but no, but guns? no guns? I don't think those are the cops, man. No, those Who are they? <laughs> those are the British guards. They're protecting the queen and they don't have guns? <laughs> Who is going to kill the queen? The king? Age. Yeah, that's about oh, it. Oh, she, R.I.P. Yeah. Well, there's another one. There's there got to be. Yeah, you don't. There's the fault. There's the vice president. Who's the, the new queen? It's like a uh, Nicki Minaj. Whoa. No. Yeah. Have you guys seen her? Camilla. What? Damn, Camilla. Doing, they got a shout out on socials or something. I don't know anything about. I her. had no idea about Camilla. She, I she waited. T. She definitely Crushing. waited her whole life to be named queen, and she's already God. about to be out. Damn, that is true. Yeah. And they always marry a King Charles. Is that? I don't know. I anything. thought it was a cocker spaniel. I'm crushing. These are jokes. And these are <laughs> What's, up, guys? What's up? What's up? Well, I didn't know we had a new queen, but yeah, there has to be a, a backup. You know, everybody. We we got second string queens. Who is she Do married to? Is she? Is, is it the same king? king Does Charles. the king just stay? Ooh. Yeah, but that's what I'm asking. So, oh fuck. Wait, that's she, true. Because like in medieval times, the kings would just stay, and they would just. This get is a your new queen. wife. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah but that's so like real life Tinder. You're like, get her out. <laughs> new wife, bring her in. Is this the new? She looks like she lives in Ohio. The the king. The king Good. wasn't married to the dead queen. The queen was the king's mom. What? Huh? And so what maybe, of porn <laughs> maybe this? this is a 23 <laughs> me that I can't run, follow. Run, run that back. Okay. Charles on September 8th, 2022. You gotta leave dates out of this. I'll be confused. <laughs> Charles became king upon the death of his mother, upon Queen Elizabeth II. <laughs> okay. okay. So there yep. wasn't a king. But yeah, there when wasn't a she king. was just queen? It must have been Who had the dirt bike? <laughs> <laughs> Josh. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Uh, yeah, she so she's queen wholesome. now. Yeah, good Dude, for her. Yeah, to, to Josh's point, if I'm 76 being a queen, I'm 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 putting every year into like two years. Mm. Like I'm putting all my years of expertise in. Oh yeah, you know, at 76, I just feel 76, like 76. I'm gonna start doing meth and fucking. Who cares? Like, like what? What is? Do do they even do anything? Do we know? Queens? Yeah. Like I don't. I think it's like a just just I like their mattresses. Thing. <laughs> What's up, dude? <laughs> what did you say? Good one. They're mattresses. Uh, what was his name? Gas company motor. David Gas. <laughs> David Portnoy. Barry, Barry Gas. <laughs> Barry Gas. Barry Gas. Anyways, there's a queen. How do we get on it? Guns. They don't have guns. They in, don't have guns in London. They don't have guns in Australia. Police. But, but do you Canada, think they, they still? Do, like, I think they. Yeah. Yeah. Do you okay, think okay. they still reach for something if they want to like intimidate you? You have like, like, a, like a little like, like a Twix. Like, or I think I think they might have like the tase guns. Oh, yeah. I think I'd rather be shot than have a tase gun. I think you look what? not you look, even no, you a little look, bit. Nah, you look no. cool getting shot. No, a tase, you, you just like. No, this is a perfect segue. Uh, have you seen those videos of the people getting tased on TikTok? No. It's. Have you seen them? No, I'm There's not like on that side of the for you page, dude. It's. I I binge watched when I was in St. Louis, just killing time, jerking off. Yes, but there's this whole like the electricity academy, <laughs> a police academy where they train and oh, they, and they tase people. See those, and dude. it's this the, the lady in the background is is it one of these like no it, type in taser test. But this lady in the background, she points the gun. She's the most like monotone voice in the world. She goes taser, 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 and then they tase them and they're like yelling and she's just still holding it. Uh, uh, go up, middle, down, down, down. What is this? The G spot, Gabe. Click it. That one. Yes, this lady. Go to their page. But who? I uh, say. Uh, where's Sam? Yeah, you got to give me just two seconds. All right, I'll give you two seconds. seconds. All right, it's going to be actually more than that. So, Canada police, no guns. You know that for sure. Yeah. Is there, like, heavy guns in Canada or no? No, it's not a big issue. I mm. think, like, I think, yeah, it's like they... It'd be guns. a great place to be strapped up because you're always wearing so much clothes because it's cold. You got, like, glocked up in a Canadian goose. Oh yeah, you no one would know. Nobody would know. No one would know. You're but not maybe, like showing your gun, your your clock print off. Maybe you know that's why people in Texas <laughs> showing your nine and your nine. Yeah. Maybe that's why people in Texas because it's so hot they want to have guns. They're wearing skinny jeans with the, with the Glock. It's like oh cool, he has he has a pistol. I love mm, seeing you actual think- cowboys. You ever seen like an actual ca- like the one? Yeah, I've been to a rodeo. Yeah, I've been to a rodeo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like I've seen a like, cowboy in like in like Houston. That's like I am a hello. I'm a oh, cowboy. Oh, like out in the wild, buddy. Like I don't a know if I've seen in one in the wild holster, like that. Holster, like a holster. Wait, where, where are you? In uh, it was Houston. I don't know yeah, where it was. I was like, I think at a gas station. But so okay. siphoning. Hey, no. But like hey, on the si- like a gun on the side. Every time I see that, I like in my dumb head, I'm like, oh man, thanks for making my Houston experience so real. And yeah, yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. That's how I felt when I went. I bought weed in Texas one time, and a yeah. guy just had a shoddy like right in between <laughs> his lap when I stepped into his car yeah. at an abandoned gas station. And you're like, for weed? 
Yeah, and I was We're like, doing this a 12 is, gauge? This is cr and he also had the pistol like right in his glove to, like compartment stuff. as well. Way too much stuff. Yeah. To Way buy too an much stuff. Weed? Yeah, yeah, it yeah. wasn't a lot. It's 50 bucks. And I was like, I was like 16. I guy definitely overcharged me, but I was like, yeah, it's okay. Oh, I'm not dude. gonna well, yeah, question you can this. You no, I got ripped yeah, off so yeah, bad. Yeah. The first time I bought weed, I was in eighth grade, and the guy literally looked out his window, saw there was two eighth graders. He was in high school, or mm. probably older. He had a fucking condo. And then he came <laughs> out. Yeah, bro. This was a was definitely older than high school. Yeah, no, no. High school was in a condo or you're, that you're, are doing well. You have to get past like a condo board. Like this guy was like 30 something. Yeah, yeah. Well, he was he old. Did, he, he did have a beard. He had a son. How old do you think he was? Yosemite? But he came out <laughs> and he like, now that I know my like weed sizes, he gave me like this much weed for <laughs> like 20. Sizes. You talk like a narc. Yeah. <laughs> weed sizes. What, what am I supposed to say? <laughs> My, no, now that I know my doses, weed measurements maybe weed measurements doses but I, but I, sounds right. But I see weed what you're doses. saying. I see what you're saying. Doses. Now that I know my it's a medical term. Well, no, I know what you mean. Because visually, you can like, oh, that's an eighth. Mm. Like visually, now you bought a yeah, 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 I understand yeah. what you're saying. When you're yeah, when you're young, you have no idea what you're. Yeah, looking. my no weed idea. sizes. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> he gave us like a nug, probably about this, maybe the size of a nickel, and was like, "This is twenty dollars worth." And I was like, "Yes, sir, it sure <laughs> is." Yeah, I mean, you don't know. I had no idea. And then this guy was like, he, he gave it to me on a Hershey's. It. It was so small that it fit in a Hershey's Kiss wrapper. That no. was the, the, oh, the, the foil? Yeah. Oh. Holy shit, that was smaller than But it. in my head, I was like, oh my God, I have the drugs. It I was, didn't care. It was also when you're that young, it was also like cool to buy it. Like, I think yeah. the experience the expe of yes. getting the weed oh, was yeah. almost more exciting I agree. than the getting high part. You also feel like you know an know? adult. You feel like an adult. You're like, oh, I purchased something from a from an abandoned gas station, as you said. And it's yeah. like, it's so fun to do yeah. it. You're not allowed to do it, but you're no, doing it with the boys. No. It's yeah, in all the yeah, journey. Yeah. It's like, whew, it was definitely my parents' down. money. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. This was the lunch money that they yes. gave me. I yeah, didn't yeah. eat today for this. I saved up a week just so I could get that weed. a problem because then you have a weed, you have no money to buy any snacks. You're hungry, you're hot. Starving, dude. What a cool time. problem to have. Oh, god damn. My name is Trevor Wallace. I'm doing stand up comedy in Irvine. <laughs> Next Thursday, March 28th, we got the new hour on the road, new material night, but we're not. Fuck, we're coming out with heaters. Heat. Fuck you, Robert. Ontario, <laughs> April 4th. Brea, California, April 11th. Long Beach, California, April 25th. And then we're back doing full weekends of touring. We're back, baby. We're back on the road. San Francisco, May 17th through May 19th. Salt Lake City, May 30th through June 1st. Miami, 305, June 21st through June 23rd. Sacramento at the end of June. Portland at the end of July. Lexington in August. Nashville in August, the end of last week of August. Tempe, Arizona, we switched the date a month later to October. If you had tickets to the September through 13th or 15th date, you'll you can use the same tickets there. You probably got an email about it. Let me know if you have any questions. Tampa, Florida. That's the end of September, September 20th through the 22nd. Tampa, Florida. TrevorWallsComedy.com. Michael Blaustein. Where you at? Michael Blaustein is gonna be yelling stand-up comedy. Guys, March 29th, Portland, Oregon. We sold the first theater out. The next theater has I think like maybe 30 tickets left, so go get your tickets. Uh, March 30th, Seattle, totally sold out. I love you guys. Uh, March 31st, Vancouver, Seoul, April 12th, Niagara Falls. Guys, these shows are going to be absolutely crazy. It's three headliner, Hannah Burner, Jessica Kirsten, and me. A um, few tickets left on the on the April 12th, April 13th. Uncastville! All right, same three head... Did I say it wrong again? No, 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 keep All right. it. All uh, right, same, same three headliners, Hannah Burner, uh, Jessica Kirsten, and me. Um, those tickets are going fast as well. Um, April 14th, Albany sold. April 18th to the 20th. Guys, San Jose, California, five shows. Go get tickets. Uh, April 25th to the 22nd, Fort Wayne, Indiana. Um, April 27th, you guys sold the first Royal Oak Michigan show out. We just added the second one. And many, many more dates on my calendar. Go to blogcomedy.com. That is blogcomedy.com. I love you. On to the mother effing show. God damn. Hey, guess what? This show is sponsored by BetterHelp. Dude. Jeez. A lot of us spend our lives wishing we had more time. The question is, time for what? Therapy can help you find what matters to you so you can do more of it. We have benefited from therapy. Here's the, you always think, at least me personally, I think that I don't need, and I'm like, yeah, no, I'll just deal with it, I'll figure it out. And then I let these things bottle up in my head and they just, they like put this like negative outlook on my head. And yep. then I talk it out and I'm like, oh, everything's fine. And then I like do the thing that we discussed, the plan, be like, all right, have this conversation, do that, here's the outcome, and then you're like, oh, whoa, this is, oh, this was all in my head. Yeah, it just sharpens the skills that you need to, like, go through moment to moment in life, dude. Being an adult, I've said this a billion times, is so 
hard and it's just like chock full of things that you just never expect when you're growing up. So if you're thinking of starting therapy, give BetterHelp a try. It's entirely online. It's awesome. You don't go to a freaking therapist's office. Wait in traffic. It's great. Designed to be convenient, flexible, and suited for your schedule. All right, just fill out a brief questionnaire to get matched with a licensed therapist and, and you know, switch therapists at any time for no additional charge if that person's not working out for you. Anytime, I, even I, in the middle of a session. Man, fuck you, Margaret. <laughs> That's what you say? You could say that. You could. I wouldn't because no. they're helping heal any trauma I have. There you go. And that's fine if you do a last shot on Margaret. That's fine. Yeah. That's what she's there for. And you know what? We're here for you. Yeah, we are. 10% off your first month. Betterhelp.com. Really? Wow. Betterhelp.com. That's betterhelp, H E L P.com slash socks. That's betterhelp.com slash socks that I can get 10% off your first month. Learn to make time for what makes you happy with better help. God damn. Remember the first time you got the munchies and you had to tell Fuck. everybody out loud? You're like, Man, is anybody else hungry right now? They're like, he must be high. Yep, yep. The first time I smoked with my friends in eighth grade, I was the first guy that got high. The rest of the group didn't. Mm. So oh. they're all looking at me like I'm a science experiment. They're like, what does it feel like? And I was like, dude, I think I'm hungry. And they're like, he's got the munchies. <laughs> yeah, so they were like stoked on it. You locked it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You locked the munchies. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He got That's it. They're just like crazy. feeding me leaves and shit. Yeah. Do you remember where you went the first time you got the munchies? <sighs> Ooh, I do. Tim Hortons. Ooh, oh, that's Timmy the most Hortons. Canadian answer yeah. I've ever heard in my it's life. It's super Canadian, but what, like... What, Timbits? Is that what they call them? Yeah, there's the Timbits there. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've been to Canada. Yeah. Timbits. And, and what do people love? There's there's like a thing out there. That everyone's like, you got to get the... Ice cap? Is, is that what that, that is? Is it the yes. drink? Yes. Yeah, the yes. ice cap is bomb. That's what I got. So I got an ice cap and a dozen donuts. Holy shit. And I just... Oh, mocked them. The yeah. Boston cream, Canadian maple, vanilla dip. Oh. Was that the type of weed you were smoking? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what's, a, what's a vanilla dip? It's like uh, just a regular donut and then it's dipped in like a vanilla icing oh, and dude, then it has incredible. like sprinkles on it. Do you think it's... In th I know your answer to this, but do you think it's really good or it's good because of nostalgia? Because I sometimes I go to like a place that someone's like, oh, you're in North Carolina, you gotta, gotta go, go here. And then you have it and it's like, fine. But mm. so much of it is nostalgia baked in. A hundred percent. There's a yeah. little bit of the nostalgia, okay. but also it's kind of Tim Hortons has fallen off a little bit ever Ooh, since no. it got bought out. And I hate to do this, but it got bought out by Burger King. Wow. So then, what yeah. a crazy acquire. Yeah. From dude. flame royals to oh, fucking yeah. Timmy Hortons. So like the the quality people are saying of Tim Hortons has gone down. I haven't been in Canada enough since that's went on to like really, I feel like compare, yeah. but a lot of people are like, it's not, it's not the same that's now so as it was, yeah. when it was. Yeah, the last time I was yeah. in Tim Hortons, it was in Michigan, I think. Yep, yeah, yep, they and have a spot out. I could have swore Burger King was in debt. I didn't know they were buying franchises. The like Burger King is doing great. Dude, they're I doing great? Buddy, I recently looked up how much it costs to franchise certain uh <laughs> Why? Why? What? What? I don't know, that I am a, I'm a Jew and I was like business let's whatever, yeah. you know? But I was trying to figure it out. I'm serious. Are you gonna franchise one? I don't know. A foot locker? I was interested. Uh but the Burger King is like, it's one of the most expensive ones to get. Dang. It's doing great. Okay. Why? I don't is know. Mob ties? I don't know. But I went to the Tim Hortons in Michigan, and it was literally like a jail cafeteria. It was not doing great. Dang. Dude, really? there okay. was two pit bulls. Literally, Working? I was... <laughs> 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 like, oh, oh, yeah. oh, oh, yeah. oh, dip. <laughs> um, oh, it was like, it was for real scary. I was also in... Never mind. What? No, I where? was going to say I'm also in Michigan. Uh, what do you mean? I don't know. Answer. Dude, the yeah. last time I said Zoom Detroit, in on him. The, no, <laughs> stop. The last time I literally Leave said it I shitted on Detroit. And I got like two death threats. No. That's it? A <laughs> two death threats turns you off? <laughs> Come on. And you say, I talk like a narc. You gotta Come be edgy on. these days. Dude, how the Look that camera in the eyes and say, fuck Detroit, Michigan. Yeah, don't be a Royal bitch. Oak, April 27th, we looked at the show. Hold on, so that's Go hilarious. storm his show. Please don't. <laughs> January 6th. So, uh, what was I saying? So, uh, re like, realistically, two death threats, you're like, who cares? Yeah. Really? Two measly threats? <laughs> I, I, but I don't get death threats, I man. had a person threaten to shoot me up while I was going to uh, Florida to talk at a university. Yeah. And I still went and did the talk. What university? Tampa? No, it was uh, the Gators. It was just, what's that? That's Gainesville? Florida, Florida Gain Gators. <clears throat> Florida Gators, yeah. 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 Wow. I mean, and dude, what was I that? They're like, if you come to school, I'll shoot you? Yeah. 
They just uh. po- and then they posted a bunch of pictures of like me with a bunch of bullet holes. Oh, like legit. And, oh, this was very real. Wow. I kind of brought it up in a joking sense, but it was very real. Holy and shit. And you just I... went? Did you well, have security? Well, you know, like there was like shit went down with that person. Like oh, there was like actual right. like, you know, like cops got involved and whatnot because it was starting to get a little wild. But yeah, then I just went and talked and it was great. Yeah, I'm good. Wow. I'm not People talking. protested, talking about the queen. They had signs saying that I was the one that killed the queen when I went and talked there. Don't Did know the at correlation. Florida? Yeah. All this? It was crazy. Was oh, it just like a generic, like, hey, he's going to be a young, successful man? Yeah, like he's going to come talk and we have someone like asking questions and, you know, you guys can learn about like entrepreneurship so and social media. With the queen? Oh, I have no idea how that got linked together, but apparently I was the one that killed her. Dude, it would be so sick if we found out in 20 out. years. It does. And then you, you brought her, yeah, then you brought her up on here to be like, oh, do they have a queen? Doesn't know. He did it. Did you do it? You heard a we'll lot right here. Back from Blue you guys got an ad read, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Blue Chew right here. Um, that's crazy. That is crazy. Yeah. yeah my, now my death threat seems stupid. Mm. I didn't think, get a picture. Do you think being a good looking man online, people are just like mad at you already, no matter what you do? You could be, I feel like you could be doing like a philanthropy event, giving away pit bulls, and somebody would be like, fuck you. Yeah, they'd probably find a problem with like the pit bulls or the something. Pit bull, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I think anyone will do something online and they'll get. You know, someone's not going to enjoy it. Yeah. Someone's going to find what a problem, pick it out. What is that? Why can't we just post one thing? It doesn't matter what it is. Yeah. It doesn't matter what it is. Like, just, I just adopted 16 babies. It I'm so happy. And they people... go, why did, Why not 17? You're like, yeah, buddy, yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, live well. in an RV. Yeah, it's Nick Cannon. Well, hold on. <laughs> yeah, it's so bizarre. I mean, Has he it, ever pulled out in his life? Nick Cannon? Yeah. Not once, dude. Not once. When that must be kind of freeing, though, to be honest. Yeah. To never have to worry about it. That's kind of cool. You know those moments you wake up, you're like, well, she has, she has the baby And I think there's her. like a certain amount of kids you get, and then you pass like child support, right? You don't have to pay like, like child tenure? support. I think it's a thing. <laughs> I think it is exactly like that. Hold on, hold on. Like so, once you have like 11 kids, you don't need to pay child support or something anymore. I feel like that's that, that called that cheaper might be by wrong. the dozen? All right. Oh, uh, is no that cap. real? No, it's not real. What? Damn. No cap? <laughs> no cap. You say no cap like... No, like yeah. no... Oh, like I, th- I thought I was like... <laughs> there is no cap. I thought he was like, no cap. Just because we have Josh talking about it, baby. <laughs> He's like, what is my TikTok lingo? Uh, no, no cap, cap. no you, cap. No cap, no condom. <laughs> could be a good title. That could be a good title. Yeah. But I'm just saying that must be pretty cool. Every single woman well, that he sleeps with just go... But imagine being kid 14. You're like, oh, great. The holidays are coming up. Does he even know my name? But who gives a... I don't give a fuck if my dad knows my name. Give me present. Yeah, I don't know if I know... 14 people in my life. I don't. I know you four guys and two other people. That's it. <laughs> my that's mom I had two kids and she would still fuck up my name. Oh, dude. My mom calls me the dog's name. <sighs> Problem? Big one. <laughs> Big one. What's the dog's name? Greta. <laughs> she, wait. She calls you your dog's name? Yes. She looks you and goes, Greta? Yeah. She'll be like, it should be like, she'll go through the whole family and literally throw Greta in there before my name. She'll be like, John, Aaron, Greta, Mike, Michael, can you get, um, oh. I think she has. Dementia. Really? That's my yeah. daughter's name. <laughs> <laughs> uh, is there she a has list? your daughter? <laughs> <laughs> is there a list of Nick Cannon's all the names of the kids? I'm There's sure no way is. he remembers all that. No. It's, no. it's got to be like one, two, three, four, five. But like, do you think he just be- does like maybe like it's like same letter? Every yeah, kid okay. starts with the same letter. But that might be confusing though for like for him too though. You know, it's like oh, easy yeah. to remember. He probably like, does a lot of like, you know when you go to a bar or an LA party, you see somebody you know from the internet but you don't really know him. It's like, uh, what's, what's up, man? Oh, How yeah, are yeah, you? Yeah, yeah. Hey, good hey, to meet you. Yo, <laughs> I mean, nice to see you again. Yeah, I think that's what he does to his own kids. He's like, yo, where, where you been? They're like, where the fuck have you been? Dude, it's been seven days. Oh, you were on Wild and Out, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You were on it? Yeah, I like did a little rap battle against them. Sick. Wait, how'd it go? Were you nervous? Were you fucking like, or you're like, oh, this is just entertainment? Um, I think I was nervous, but I think, yeah. you know, I was also like having fun with it. I know yeah. like it was going to go on and... I didn't realize- Are you one of his kids? You guys are finding way too much about me on this show. We'll be right back. You killed the queen and you're Nick Cannon's kid? (laughs) A full list of Nick Cannon's children. Um, We've got some names here. Uh, Moroccan Cannon, Monroe Cannon, um, Golden- Golden Sagan Cannon. That sounds like a very good restaurant in Van Nuys. Golden Sagan. Um, We've got Powerful Queen Cannon. That- Stop. (laughs) Right there. (laughs) Everyone stop. She was born in 2020, Michael. This was the pandemic days. Like, powerful she is a, queen? She's a powerful queen cannon. I want to take off the queen and just name my kid Powerful Cannon. <laughs> <laughs> just like a really good camera. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't even think about that. I didn't even think that dude, the name is Powerful Cannon. Dude, that's so funny. 
The next, the but thirteenth imagine, is going to be the Nikon cannon. The bro's going to be at the DMV one day, going powerful cannon, <laughs> crazy. Not your name is a death threat. I don't huh? like it. Zion, go ahead, read that last one. What's that name say? That's a fucking. That's for the virus. That's the new fentanyl. <laughs> no, that's, for, that's a COVID vaccine right there. <laughs> Mixolydian. And Mix zil zillion air. Zillion Ooh, air. that one's clean. Zillion's kind of sick. Zillion I'm not gonna air is clean. Oh, hold on. I just got it. Zillion yes. air. Stop zillion it. air. Yeah. Nick. <laughs> Nick. <laughs> He's ahead of his time. Zen cannon. Zen. That's fire. That's I like that. Zen is great. Zen is cool. Yeah, Zen is All these bad. are just based on how he's feeling these days. He's like, I'm <laughs> feeling rich. <laughs> how am I I'm zillion air. Yeah. Someone I'm read. Zen. Someone I'm feeling read legendary. That. Dude, the legendary love cannon. How have none of these been like addressed to the public? I, I'm literally reading these because there's this too is a many bit. of them. Wait, legendary, I, legendary love. He has a daughter with Brie Tessie. Oh, I know that. Girl. I went to college with her. I did. That's my mom. I did Selling Sunset with her. You want Selling Sunset? Too? Yeah, dude. What? And you're in a movie with Nicolas Cage. You're in fucking everything. Wait, Brie Tessie. I think she. I did know this click, actually. Click, it, click her page. I knew this. Yeah, yeah. Any of those? Oh, now I'm thinking about. Yep. Oh right, she's. In a lot of, I've seen some of his videos. Okay, so they're yeah, they're together now. How did oh, they're they're together now. It looks like it, right? If this was posted oh. twenty three hours ago. Oh yeah, then definitely. Yeah, and that kid was born twenty twenty one. And what was the name? Uh, <laughs> Legendary Love Cannon. That's the name of my dick. <laughs> <laughs> Legendary love cannon. That's <laughs> crazy, dude. We're not and we're not even halfway done. <laughs> <laughs> Onyx ice coal cannon. No, that's hard. ice that's coal hard. cannon. I is, like that's that. hard. I that's like hard. That. Ice that cannon be a Pokemon. Great. Ice coal cannon. Onyx. Onyx definitely has to be a Pokemon, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a hog grabber for sure. Rise, uh, Messiah, Rise Messiah, Messiah cannon. cannon. Rise um, Messiah. I'm out. Wait, but this is September. that that one. That one had to be a little controversial. Rise Messiah yeah. Canon. You're Rise calling Messiah. your kid the Messiah, essentially. You're like, and Rise Messiah. Yeah. Come God. out of this womb and he, dude. The, all these names are great. I think we're going. They're uh, good. Uh, Gabe, I think we're going backwards in time. Uh, no, this is oh, 2022. No, we're not. No, we're not. Yeah. This, Wait, this seems like full two, two This feels like a random rap name generator. It like really there should be an, there should cannon. be an app that's called like Nick Cannon Name Generator, and you're like your son is named Beautiful Zeppelin Cannon. <laughs> What's a Zeppelin? Uh, he definitely did shrooms and like listened yeah, to Led yeah. Zeppelin that yeah, yeah, day, yeah. and then was like, this he is didn't, gonna be my kid. He did now. shrooms and listened to like a bush, and just like, <laughs> oh, that said this. You can tell too that like he decides on all of these names because these are all multiple different mothers, and all the names are the same genre of names. So yeah. like the mothers He's have no input. Oh, yeah, 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 hundred well, percent. Yeah. Wait, are all these different moms? This is also a lot like of them are. Yeah, Abby De La Rosa, Alyssa thick. Scott, and these are all. Wait, okay. Did you say thick? No, I one said month thick. apart. Oh, I you said well, thick. probably. <laughs> these probably. Two, these are one month apart. Two different moms. Wow. Yep. Um, 2022 has three He's different moms. Ladies and gentlemen, what can I say? He Funny. is working. <laughs> yeah, three, three Four. moms in 2022. He's building Four it. moms in 2022. Ooh. And all of them like three months apart. Oh, hold what on. What does that group chat look like? <laughs> I mean, Do you think a lot they did guns. like the baby shower together? <gasps> oh, like a joint oh, joint yeah, custody yeah, baby yeah, shower, yeah, yeah, and then yeah, the yeah. gender reveal. It's like he's just doing tours. He just pops by for for dude, ten minutes. Dude, the fourth gender reveal. He's like, oh, I don't give a fuck, dude. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. He's building an empire. He's literally building like a like a Tyler Perry empire with his family. <laughs> <laughs> did you? Can we look up his net worth? I know it's not right, but like, can we get an in yeah. and, in and around? And how much does he spend on? Hold on, uh, can we guess real quick? Um, I'm gonna go three hundred million. Yeah, I'd say around that. Yeah, I would say okay. maybe yeah, three hundred million. I'll go on the low side. Okay, uh, parade.com. Let's see. Fifty. Are any of these accurate? No, they're not. I've looked at my own. My mom sent me my own one day, and I was like, "Why are you googling this?" What does it say? He told the LA Times recently he makes a hundred mil a year. No, he doesn't. Uh, they Some estimate life. his net worth at fifty mil. That, Hilarious. Who's doing this? <laughs> That's parade.com. That's what it like. How much do you make a year? Hundred mil net worth fifty. Oh, mil. they literally <laughs> just lift it from here. He's like, I'll make hundred million. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's no, the most know. irresponsible spender ever, or well, well, they dude, just he, don't believe he him. Has, he has a football team for a family. <laughs> so many yes. people. God damn. This episode is brought to you by our boys at Manscaped, dude. Embrace the season and join the 10 million men worldwide who trust Manscaped with our special offer, okay? Go to manscaped.com and use code STIFF for 20% off plus free shipping, dude. Listen, it's spring break. There's a good chance the hog might be out. Yep. You know, man, this guy's personality sucks. Hope he has a cool car. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've heard many women say that. Look, we both use Manscaped. We trim I, it up, type five on the side. Buddy, <laughs> I forgot mine on tour. I was gone for 11 days, didn't trim it up. 
My shit looked like a fucking Bigfoot. I tried to take a picture of it. It was blurry. Guys, it sucked. Yeah, but you got back and you trimmed it up. Trimmed it up, dude. And here's the beautiful part. Manscaped is so much bigger than just the Lawnmower 5.0. Yeah. They have everything on it. They oh. have ball deodorant. They have boxers. They have regular deodorant. They have body wash, which smells phenomenal. I'm wearing the boxers right now, Not guys. Not an ad. Psych is an ad. It is He's an ad. wearing the boxers. Okay, the Lawn Mower 5.0 Ultra is what I use. It's the fifth generation trimmer. Features two. I said right. I said two interchangeable next-gen skin-safe blades. Heads. Head. A standard one for taking a little off the top and a new foil blade to go smooth wherever your heart desires. That means your asshole. So get 20% off and free shipping with code STIFF at manscaped.com. That's 20% off and free shipping with code STIFF at manscaped.com. Nothing like a little spring cleaning in your cock. The battery never <laughs> dies. You trim it up. I think I've charged it once. It's waterproof. It's got an LED light on it's it. It's got they, a light on they it. They have a light on it. Just, just fancy me this. Go to the website. Check it out. Manscaped.com. See what you fall in love with. Do it. God damn. Have you seen those clips of the no. Jake Paul? Have you seen the ones of, of Mike boxing? Yeah. Mike is bro, in shape. Bro. He's in shape. It's, it's going to be such a problem. Do you think he's going to wipe the floor with Jake? I think they're going to drag it out for yeah. until, as long as they can just yeah. to keep building revenue. And I think they're both entertainers. They're both performers. But I think eventually Mike will knock him out. And I like Jake. I just, you know, he's, he's a friend of mine and whatnot. But, like, did you see these clips of him, like, boxing is I don't know. I think to me I'm just like I get it's Mike Tyson, right? And, yeah, he looks good. But he's also, like, he's 60, dude. Yeah, but he's literally a – he's a monster. Like, he's not a regular human being 60. He's yeah, I get He's an actual monster. That's 60. I, th I think he has years building up in him. Like, he doesn't snap oh, yeah. often, but when he does, there's some other clips. There's a clip where he's legit beating his trainer's ass. Holy shit. He has a he six He looks pack? good, dude. dude he he looks does look hot. good. Yeah, he's kind of just to your point, like insane. Like, he does mushrooms a bunch and he smokes a bunch. So he's just kind of like mentally, like, think he can lock he in. He just when eats he like to. handfuls of shrooms. Oh, yeah. Maybe it's on TikTok if you want to see it. Also, yeah. I want to see the, the taser clip. Oh, yeah. I think it's, it's audio should be working now. You want to watch this? Just listen to the girls. First of all, she starts just strapped. She's holding it for a good She's 10 ready. minutes. She hates this man. He, he ate her tuna sandwich that week. You are. Wait for it. Yeah. He's reevaluating my decisions right now. Shoot it. Shut up. Shoot it. Taser, taser, taser. I was trying to like think about can we say something nicer than taser, taser, taser? Like, couldn't they say something a little more friendly? It's Tay Tay time. Crazy. That's the sound I make when my girlfriend fingers my ass. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I mean, go back. What is this for? Is this training? I, it, like, yeah, that's what. It's my, my question. Do we know? Uh, is that guy I part think of like some it, police academy? Is like is police that guy training? Like you got to be like, I don't know. Uh, yeah. Missouri. Missouri yep, that answers everything. College law enforcement academy. Yeah. College. So they do this so in case they get in the field or they get astray. I guess they know what they're dealing with because a lot of these guys will do pepper spray. Yeah, they do the pepper spray one too. There's whole yeah, challenges to like no. Also, how it like if I'm doing this, I'd be like, hey, you guys maybe mind not filming me at my like most painful moment. So also, how does this get fucking 54 million views? I, I, don't, I say the word shit in a video and they're like, yeah, you can't cut. <laughs> this man is dying. Oh. That woman is screaming for her life. Dude, Dude she sounds like a, so she sounds like an air mattress losing <laughs> air. <laughs> Play some other ones with you? Yeah. Uh, it's just the lady in the back is my favorite. She just stays glossed. Taser, taser, move. taser. Taser, taser, taser. Yeah, like, let's get a little bit more, like, have Bruce Buffer back there. Yeah. Funny. Time. <laughs> this might be a new lady. Here we go. Work. Come on. You got it. Talk, talk to you. Say your name. Just say your name. Say your name. Say your name. It's kind of like media censorship. Pull Shoot it. it. What's with the big warm up? I don't know. Maybe they're trying to hit the one on one minute on here. Monetize. Get that monetization. Taser, taser. Yeah. No, same woman. The way she said it. Taser, taser, taser. <laughs> oh, that guy was actually pretty good. He just thought I went, oh, fuck. The other guy lets out like this like war cry, which I would too. I mean, I think you should use that to filter who's going to be an actual cop and who's not. If a Maybe. dude goes, oh, mama, you can't be a cop. Yeah, but, but if you do that, cop. Mm. Yeah. You know? What, did it? This seems way more intense when you guys got tased. Was it when you guys got tased? Was it no, this like. This is like a. It shoots in your skin and then the bolts oh, go out. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. This got is a wire. Yeah. yeah so the, like oh, it the, breaks your skin. The wire. Yeah, yeah, and then they yeah. pull the trigger and the bolts go into you. The, the taser we did with Steve O was like. 
it's I don't like know. one of the ones like a yeah. chick will carry in her purse. Kind yeah, of thing. exactly. Yeah. You know, yeah. there's an app Still on your hurts. phone. You can do it. It <coughs> makes a noise. It's kind of smart. Oh, so like you can hide it in your yeah. purse and like pretend you're yeah, making you noise. Like, focus and then like they'd be like, oh, fuck, there's a yeah. taser in her bag. Yeah, I know. Also, we'll also we'll do it with like a, uh, there's like police radio scanners. If you ever feel like scared, you can like play those. Because then if somebody like, oh, wow. What a great idea. Yeah. Mm. So if you're yeah, watching alone and I play a police scanner, everybody's like, whoa, this fucking chick's hot and a narc, you know? Is right. this the video you're talking about? Maybe. There's yes, Only this one. He beats He's his legit butt. like beating his traitor's ass. Like that's crazy. Ugh. Like he's I'm not yeah. gonna lie, dude. Tyson got a thumper on him. Look at that ass. Are I you mean, it, me? I think it's the TikTok like thirst trap song or just like the edit that's really getting me going, but he's he's beating ass. No, yeah, he's he does look good. It'll be It'll be, I hope it's fun to watch. I hope it's not just like uh, this guy signed a contract saying like, all right, we'll go eight yeah, rounds. I have yeah. a fear that you hit me out. Right. Like, cause I see this being like a, a money grab a little bit. Yo, yeah. yeah. You know? To bring Tyson out of, I don't know if he's retired, but to bring him back in the ring. And it's like, this is, they're both entertainers. They're the end of yeah. the day. They know they're and do that for the Roy Jones. It's Roy Jones, right? When they fought Tyson, last time, the last person he fought was Roy Jones, right? Am I? I'm just remembering this, uh, I but I think that's what they did with the exp expedition. Jesus, what is it? A Ford? The thing where they they fought like <laughs> exhibition. Six, thank you so yep. much. They they did like Canada. six rounds of like kind of fuck around, and the last two rounds were like actual fighting. But even the actual fighting was just like yeah, it just seems. I, I wonder if like I mean I I know it does, but do you think he thinks it tarnishes like a legacy that he has or no? Do you think, think he's so. just like I need? The, I, I, I want the bag. If he wins, yeah. they're like good fuck Jake Paul, and if he loses, they're like it's a money grab. Yeah, but like that nobody, would tarnish your legacy in a way. Yeah, but nobody really talks about like Floyd Mayweather and like Logan Paul. I don't know who won that one, so I don't know why I'm talking on it. But nobody's like, yeah, you you went from this to fighting that guy. Yeah, I guess so. I guess I feel I, like people will forget about it. Yeah, I, he'll I think always be Mike Tyson. If he gets knocked out yes. immediately, then definitely. Yeah, then it's like, oh wait, hold on, maybe this was real. But it's, yeah. it's weird though, or they'll because, say it's because Tyson rigged. can't. I don't think Tyson can lose like tarnish anything because he's an older guy. So if he gets knocked out, everyone's like, bro, he's an older guy, man. Yeah, then yeah. It's almost like a lose-lose on the Jake side. Correct. Of yeah. Right. If correct. he wins, he goes, Besides the bag Jake's going to be I mean, be stupid. Doing Do we even know? I guess we don't know until the pay-per-views come out. I could see Jake, like, walking away with $20 million. Yeah, it's going to be huge. Mother of because God. Because it's on Netflix and it's live stream. Oh, it's yeah. on Netflix. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm right, saying. Dude. Like, I can see that being $20 mil. Dude, right? it's gonna be. Yeah, he's oh, made yeah. more than that from other fans. and endorsements. Whatever he wears on his shorts, exactly. You know? Exactly. He has like the big Celsius deal or whatever too. Yeah. Right? Like you throw all that stuff in. Tyson will have that life alert deal. Like it is gonna Bro, be a it's big, gonna be a big one. I mean, yeah, you can't say no on either side of that. But how it, much money would it take you to get in the ring with Tyson if Tyson was like, "I'm going to try to kill you." Like not an not an ex, ex but like there's a the ref there to like break it up. Yeah, but I'm you, you take you take one hit from Tyson, dog. Like you're gonna then I'm KO'd. The match is over. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> then, I'm, I'm taking one hit, dead, and then I'll though. take my twenty million dollars and get out of there. Yeah. yeah, but you might have like a broken spleen the rest of your life. Like, or you could he's like spleen punching me. Dude, he's, Where's he hitting he's, me? Uh, he's gonna try to kill. I don't know. You ever you seen that? That's not a human being. No, no, yeah, it's not a human being. So but like, like, how much are you taking? I. Uh, I, I'm taking, I'm taking, I'm taking 10 mil and right when the bell goes, I'm going to start upping my uppercutting myself until I You don't need out. to do that. That's not going to No, that's no, not going to I'd rather, <laughs> no, but, but Tyson hit me like there's a chance that I'm for real going to die. Like getting hit and dying, yes, it's super rare, but like it's a Here's real what thing. I'm, doing. I'm drinking a lot because you know how people in drunk driving accidents, bear with me, drunk driving accidents live longer because they're not as tense when they get hit. Yep. Yeah. Yep. So I'm going to be hammered. And then I'm just gonna have him just open fit, like open slap me, pretty much. You know that's why like babies can survive being dropped from high heights. Oh, because they don't know. Because they happening? they don't like tense up. That's uh, like they, what a they cool say, way to fall. They're like, yeah, man, I don't give a shit. I don't give a <laughs> fuck. <laughs> like, I'm pretty sure like you can like throw. No, I don't suggest trying this. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. like they say, like you know, okay, if like your house is burning down and you're on like the second story, right? You could drop your baby down and it. Probably will live. Asterisk, asterisk, asterisk. Don't do don't it. Do this. Don't do this. Allegedly for say, say that 16 times. Who knows? Oh, but because they're like. Because they don't like, they don't like tense up or they don't, they don't like, you know what I'm saying? And the bones aren't fully aren't, formed. Yeah. So they're, they're kind of wobbly. Yep. That's why. Parents I'm, dropping that many kids. Like, you know how like there's a joke like, oh, I was dropped on my head as a child. Is that pretty yes. frequent? Oh, I bet you it happens a lot more than you even think it yeah. does. Yeah. Yeah, our yeah, other dude, producer's not like, here today. I think he got dropped once or twice as an adult. Once so. or twice. Oof. Yeah, but hey, he's doing all right. 
But yeah, do, were, were you guys dropped? Do you guys know this? I I don't know if I was dropped. I was I mean, definitely dropped. I got to assume every baby gets a head bonk. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. Like you're like playing with the kid, throwing it up, maybe a little fan action. Yeah. Maybe there's a little bit like it, holding it in one hand, cupboard door to the head. Dude, yeah. especially it's in just LA, building up endurance. Especially in LA, every mom's like, oh, like ODing on Ozempic. You yeah. know, the, people are getting dropped. Yeah. I definitely sure. got dropped. Everyone in my family's pretty, um, my dad's a little wild, but everyone in my family's pretty even keeled, good grades, focused, and I'm a lunatic. So somewhere along the way I was dropped. Yeah. Mid. Maybe punted, if we're being honest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was going to say a little spike action. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that, oh, you think Shotgun set, happened? Mike. You. <laughs> Michael Blaustein. Um, I, I am curious. Um, TikTok ban. Are you think it's happening? Or is it all pretty much oh. just bullshit? Because this gets rehashed like every, every six every months. Like two right? years. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah. oh, it's going to happen. Then nothing happens. It's going to happen. Nothing happens. I mean, I think this is like the most serious. I yeah. feel like we've seen yeah, it. Okay. Right? With like the bill and whatnot. Um, I think that TikTok is such a powerful tool for small business and businesses. Of course, in, in, yeah. Like that, there wouldn't, there won't be someone that doesn't come in and buy TikTok and make it where like we just continue it's not just gonna within disappear. Like, like there's no, I can, gone. I can't see a world where it's just like, oh, it's gone and eliminated and. Not, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, it's yeah. I think it would affect too many Americans' guys, so. lives, too. There's like 300,000 American jobs that are provided from TikTok. Is it really? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the number. So it's oh, like uh, there's a lot of people. I know that there's obviously a ton of small business that uses TikTok. If we right? get rid like, of the TikTok shop, great, good. Fuck them. Yeah, but Enough the, the people that candies. Yeah, I, th yeah. I think that's why, it's to his point, I think that's why it's going to exist longer because of the shop. I mean, I think, you know, the shop, <laughs> but I think the way that people are successfully starting small businesses is more than just the TikTok shop. You know what I mean? Yeah, like yeah, there's yeah. people that are doing really cool marketing tactics on TikTok or even like companies like Coca-Cola, like they see the value in TikTok, right? Like they know it's a place where there's all these young eyeballs and they can go and market their product yeah. to like, so I don't know. I think it's, I think it's a little crazy. I think there's so much about it. like Joe Biden being like, I'll it's, sign the bill if it comes across my desk, but I'm also going to continue to use TikTok to help me campaign. That's also very true. What? Like, yeah, pick a side. That, you that, can't just, like, be like, yeah, America, yeah, yeah. you decide, and I'll, like, hey, whatever you come guys along, want. Yeah, and I'll also, do both. And yeah. it's like, fuck I mean, off. he's running for office, dude. He's, he's got to be the most diplomatic person ever. Just this widespread of, like, yes and no, but maybe, and yeah, it's like, you can't, you can't make a, you can't make a deciding factor because you need to appeal to everybody. Isn't it just like, so weird that the highest level of our regulation is, like, talking about TikTok? Like the, oh I said, my gosh, the, yeah. The, do you see the Nancy Pelosi one where she's talking about TikTok? I don't know if it's just the one where she oh, does like just, the yeah, tic, tic tac toe yeah. and she tries to have like <laughs> a bird <laughs> and everyone's like, it's a pulled up. It's kind of like bars, but it's also kind of like there's bigger things to solve <laughs> in the world. Yeah. Just buy the like, app. Yeah. Then uh, like this data, data information. Sell more tickets. <laughs> 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 where is This everybody? girl's trying to do a stand up. Where is no there, bro? <laughs> this door deal is horrible. Dude, this is a matinee show in Burbank. What is this? <laughs> Important issue and I think the distinguished chairwoman walked out. <laughs> like I was like, the lady behind shit. her is 1000% a bird in disguise. <laughs> <laughs> that lady behind her is half asleep, man. Yeah. yeah. Not at all. I, I don't know where it is, but China for their great leadership, bring this legislation forward. She's just doing shout outs right now. She's just trying to. Hey, yo, shout out China, yeah, shout out TikTok, yeah. shout out Biden. She thinks she's on TikTok live right now. <laughs> Thank you for the rose. <laughs> Thank you for the rose. Thank you for the rose. <laughs> it's attempt to make TikTok better. Tick tack toe. A winner. <laughs> bars, Dude, dog. Honestly, that's hard. I don't care how what did, you say. That was good. That how was did they good. not cut to a wide of the whole auditorium and just, oh! <laughs> just cuts back to like the <laughs> Def Jam tapes? Like, you know, that was in her head. Like, this is going to crush. And she didn't get the response she deserved. That's no, she, no she, she should have had a game. super hot fire response. Yes. She should have been able to lead She's back. Literally, yeah. had, like 20 guys. Mark like, Zuckerberg should have walked in and be like, here's the keys to Facebook. Yeah, oh, dude, they should have cut to like a Def Jam footage That's after what I'm she said that. Yeah, God damn it. I just think this whole thing is about Mark Zuckerberg wanting to have the control of data. That's what I really is that think it? this of is course, all about. Of course, because it's an American company. Yeah, it's, it's like, bunker? oh, they have the data, but it's like, you guys are pitching all these like people that you're about this huge like data privacy, and this is why we need to ban TikTok. But all of your platforms steal our data anyways. It's like, like they, yeah, they were doing it first. TikTok started doing it better. Now they're pissed that all that data is not theirs. What yeah, do you do I just it? think like if you want to protect the data, then like do 
do a bill that protects us from our data being or like data being leaked. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. don't just like be like, oh, well, TikTok's the the wrong piece of uh, plat like platform to use. It's like all these platforms are taking it. So that's just how I. I mean, you know, yeah, I'm not yeah. a professional, but you kind of, but you are though. Like in the social media realm, it's like people that know it. I would say we're all pretty equipped in this world. We know it so well. It's like what the fuck is Nancy Pelosi? I and <laughs> I don't know. I don't know anything about Nancy Pelosi. I do. Nancy Pelosi. Uh, she cheats Wall Street every year and a half. She makes millions of dollars. What, what side is she on? Buddy, she's she on the side of the green side. Yeah, this Democrat. bitch making dollars. There's literally, you can, I can't, I think there's a thing where you can uh, invest your money in the same thing that Nancy Pelosi does because Nancy Pelosi beats the stock market every year. She's she an just NFT? Gets, she gets like, you know, whatever, like she's insider information. She's better picking stocks than, what's his name? Uh, Warren Buffett. Thank you, Warren yeah. Buffett. She's literally she she's yeah. better at picking socks because she's no she's doing insider trading <laughs> all the fucking time, mm. and she's never been cl so. Why is she talking on TikTok? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, give me when, some insider trading. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> the algorithm. What's the Dow Jones looking like? <laughs> Who is Dow Jones? Is he a dude? Indiana. <laughs> He's the other commercial agent from earlier. <laughs> <laughs> but like, is Dow Jones and like Dow Jones? Is that his real name? Is that a person? No. Oh, okay, it's an acronym. Is it? Daily owning wages. That's pretty good. Anyways, <laughs> I don't know. God damn. Factor! Yes, I eat these every single day. I just got a notification on my phone right now. <laughs> Factor sent to my house. Fact is, this is an ad. Every fresh, never frozen meal is chef crafted, dietitian approved, and ready in just two minutes. You literally take it out. You take it out, it's never frozen, refrigerated, pop, 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 shank it up a little bit. Two minutes in the microwave, you can eat it, and this is what I love about it. Uh oh. No mess. No mess. You, you, oh, you wasted a fork? You throw it away. Throw the, honestly, throw the fork away. Um, and it's awesome. I dude, I've eaten it in my car because yes. I'm late to go to the studio, yes. dude. Literally, and same. they're not, and the meals are incredible, dude. I, no, I've had my doubts, and I take a bite. I'm like, this is better than anything I would cook, honestly. I mean, it, I, I am, I, dude. Factor is the perfect. Too. Yes, dude. And you get to pick it if you don't like you certain things. You, you get to pick, uh, you, you know, add-ons, yes, smoothies, juices. So, Factor is a perfect solution if you're looking for fast premium options with no cooking required, dude. Okay, sign up and save. We've done the math. We have, dude. Factor is less expensive than takeout. It so is that every meal is dietitian approved to be nutritious and delicious. So, head to factormeals.com slash socks50 and use code socks50 to get 50% off. That's a lot of 50s. That's code socks50 at factormeals.com slash socks50 to get 50% off. God damn. Do you feel like TikTok is like, is, are, are your numbers still crushing or are you like, oh, what the fuck is this? Yeah, I feel like it's still good. I mean, it's obviously, I think TikTok's just changed from what it was in like 2019. Yeah, 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 you know yeah, what yeah. I'm saying? Or like 2020. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. it's such a, what, like, there's so much on the platform now and there's so many different like sides of the platform yeah. now that I think it's just like a little bit of a different game. It's I'd not, say so. It's not like before where you just like, you know, me and the Sway Boys are posting a video of us shirtless and it's like, oh, there's, 35 million views on yeah. that video. Yeah, you know yeah, what yeah. I mean? Content it's like, consuming. now it's like, you got to be a little bit more clever, I think, with your content. The viewer is just getting smarter and smarter and desire. There's also much more to compete with, I would say. Yeah. yeah. And like, I think also like, the viewer that I was making videos for in 2019 is now older. You know what True. I mean? Like, I think smart. a lot of my Very audience smart. has aged up as well. So it's like, they don't necessarily gravitate to the same stuff they used to. Yeah, I think, I think it's also too, like the, the whole like meta thing, right? It's like, I think now TikTok is sort of like that because like Instagram and Facebook, they had so much content, but TikTok didn't. So mm. you could post one thing oh, and it go crazy. Yeah, yeah, now yeah. I think the viewership or like the the amount of views you can get per video is almost similar to now what Instagram and, and Facebook is because they're the same amount of viewers now. Does that make sense? Like, I think so. Yeah. I just think I don't see videos go viral like they do on TikTok anywhere else. Right. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. like the Uno edit, for example. Yeah, did you guys that. see that? That the, like started crushing edit, or whatever? Like the, yeah. the dog one. You don't hear about like, oh, did you guys see this crazy Instagram reels that has 17 yeah. million likes? Right. You know what I'm right. saying? Right. Like, right. it's, I just still think TikTok kind of has that ownership on social media. They do. Like, it, everyone it breaks is, videos on there and then it. Goes, goes to other places. Right? Yeah, like, right, they're right, like the right. distributor. They're like the moderator of what's going to be viral. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I've, oh, I've seen all types yeah. of different changes because I think now it's delayed, at least for me. Like I used to post like pandemic and it would be like a million in like 
instant an hour. Yeah. Yeah. And you're an like, hour. oh, and, yeah. and now and you, you could track how good a video yeah. was doing after an hour. You yeah. always kind of knew, and now it's that's like, what fucks me up. Now you have no fucking clue. No, I have no idea. Yeah. I, I talked to my TikTok rep, and they're like, yeah, give it like you know, like three to four days. I'm like, that's not that's not what like I need that immediate yeah. dopamine yeah. hit that it used to be. <laughs> Posting on TikTok used to we're be social like, media influencers. We want like <laughs> instantaneous now. gratification. Yeah. But it's like I posted something that like got like a hundred thousand views on TikTok. I'm like, damn, this fucking flopped. Put it on Instagram, 30 million views. Dude, what is, I had the yeah, exact yeah. same thing happen. Exact, like exactly. Yeah. Posted like a sketch. Didn't do the greatest on my TikTok. And I was like, dang, I thought that was going to kill. Yeah. Go and post it on my my reels, 29 million views or yeah. something. Yeah, it's like so like, bizarre. What the hell? Your sketch show is phenomenal, by the way. Thank you. Man. I was bummed Thank I couldn't you. make it. We, the, we were trying to be in uh, one of the frat alien sketches. Yeah. The canceled sketch was great. That's the one you're talking about. That's that was great. It was so good. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, that's what we opened up with. Funny thing is, is that was like one of my least favorite sketches. Really? really? So I always think it's different, you know, when you're like in it and you're in the whole entire creative process and you've seen the sketch or you've worked on the script a million times, I think like some of the humor you start to get lost oh, in yeah, almost yeah. or like yeah, it becomes you've like- staring at it for yeah, too long. You, yeah, you're staring at it for such a long time and I went around our room when we were trying to figure out, you know, what sketch do we want to start the show off with? And- over half the room was like, I think we open up with this one. Like, I think it's funny. I think people won't realize if it's the yeah, sketch show yeah, or not. Yeah. They'll think like, maybe this is Josh just apologizing oh, for something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, I looked and I was like, did anyone laugh in this video? Like, did, did any of you guys think this was funny? And they were like, yeah. And I was like, all right, I guess I'll start with it. Like, I'll like yeah. if you guys are really about it, like I I'll listen to my team here. Like I it's, this is this is a cool one, I guess. And I put it out, and I'm so happy that was the first one that we put out. And yeah. and yeah, it, it was a it's it was just a great really first funny sketch. because there's a new like viral cancellation video every like three or four months. Like the Miranda sings one is like, I mean, bro, iconic. iconic. I it, mean, apology of apology videos, right? Like, dude. it's it's in the Hall of Fame. I mean, that was her. <laughs> she thought it was going to be like the Nancy Pelosi effect, like tick tack tock. You know, when yeah. she was like, they said I couldn't say it, but I can sing it. She thought that would be like, like wow. Let's yeah. go. Let's yeah. go. And the lawyers right. are like, fuck. <laughs> I didn't think of that. <laughs> She's singing about it. But there is so many of those. And, there, and the canceled videos are always funny. I was thinking about making a video about this years ago. It's like, Rich people trying to find the shittiest place in their house to build a cancel video because they never <laughs> want to do it in front of their like Lambo or yeah, their, like, yeah, 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 their, yeah. Their, their infinity pool. It's always like in a corner of their laundry machine. There's like just change rattling in the washing <laughs> yeah. machine. I'm so sorry for what I did. It's like, You're in a thirty million dollar mansion. Yeah, show bro. that. Yeah, it's always on. in black and white for some reason. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> they're just trying to milk it. So I, I thought that was really well. Yeah, done. I think it's one of those ones that can live forever too, right? Like at any time you can oh, go yeah, and watch dude. that, and it's still a video that'll hit. It's not like super timely or anything like well, dude, that. They're, they're no, people always be fucking up. Forever. Yeah. Like they tried to impeach presidents like fucking 90 years ago and they're having canceled. That's also funny. Like Richard Nixon did a canceled video. Wait, did he? Wait, oh, Buddy. Yeah, that's so funny. That, he that. literally did a fucking. He All that's missing was the thumbnail and the was title. Was he like the first said, guy to get canceled? He. True. Like, was he the first apology video? M maybe, but the funniest thing ever on his apology video, he finished it, said bye, and then just got into a helicopter and <laughs> left. Well, that's on the that's fucking the, TV. That's the George Bush one. What is that again? <laughs> or, or, that's separate, but like the, the timing where he goes like, we got to fight these terrorists. Now watch me hit this drive. <laughs> Have you seen that video? No. Type in George Bush. Uh, now watch me hit this drive. And uh, please bring up the Nixon thing. It's so funny, dude. Like to apologize. goes and it's and a golf swing. Yeah. Proceeding yeah. being like, we need to get these terrorists. Oh, it's, yeah. Yeah. It's one That's of the best fucking videos. America, it's one of the best dog. videos ever. That's that America. is America. I was, I was too young to understand George Bush back in the day, but like this guy's kind of electric. On all nations to do everything they can to stop these terrorist killers. Thank, Thank you. you. Now watch this drive. <laughs> <laughs> Does he smash it too? Oh, not a bad swing, dude. Dude, Straight down the middle, they said. Follow through. Do you think it was like super far left, and they just have to lie to him? Yeah, they're the same time. It hit a fucking turtle. Like, it didn't, like, oh, down the middle, down yeah. the middle. <laughs> hey, yo, drop, drop the ball tower. in the middle of the fairway. Yeah. Drop the ball in the middle of the fairway. Drop it in the hole. <laughs> but so funny. I don't. What context is going on here? Is like we need to stop terrorism. All right. But also, watch me, watch me 325 <laughs> down the fairway. But it's dude. also, dude, get in the office and work, bitch. You're on a Presidents are never in the office. What are they doing? <laughs> I wouldn't be in the office either, the White House. That shit looks just drafty. It doesn't look fun. It looks fun. dry. It looks like you get a sinus infection in there. Yeah, it doesn't So Bill look Clinton, when okay. he went on record, be like, I didn't do it. That was the opposite. He went the Miranda Sings approach. Yep. Mm. Or Miranda Sings went the Bill... Yep. Wait, yeah, Miranda would have copied. Yeah. 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 I did not have sexual relations with that woman is hilarious. But because the girl's did. like, the girl's like, because she's still wiping did. semen off her face. Like, <laughs> yeah. no, you did. Like, how, like, watching a, a, a liar lie 
is literally hilarious because your dick is wet still. <laughs> and you're being like, I did not have. Yes, you did, though, Bill. But still like, zipping up his pants. <laughs> I did not. Have. Yeah. But was that his PR team? You're like, yeah, you got to just no everything. No, deny, deny, deny. But it's weird, though, because now it's like there's so much uh, availability to find someone who's lying. But back then, dude, there's not a lot of availability. Yeah, there was no receipts. Yeah, there yeah was it was no like, it was like, it's your like, word versus my word. Who are they yeah. going to believe? The yeah. president? Yeah. Or, you know what I'm <laughs> yeah. saying? Intern, like, yeah. That's probably the move. He was like, this is what we're going to pull. Is yeah. it a video or is it just on radio? I just want to... Is that Hillary? Hillary, dude. She's got to be by the side? Have to be. Hey, that's crazy. She was hot. Man. Dude, she's she's not even by the side. She is front and center. Hillary's kind of a piece. She kind of was. Uh, kind of a piece, kind dude. Back piece. in the day, she, we already looked at pictures of her back in the day. Hillary is she, was, was she bad, bad like that? Sir. Yeah. Bad. Really? Yeah. Oh, like, like, library, like, like, like library hot. You're like, damn. If yeah, I saw yeah, you yeah, had a blue yeah, bottle yeah. of coffee, I'd cry. You know how to read? Like, <laughs> hot. <laughs> nice. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we now, I have to go back to work on my State of the Union speech. Nice. And I worked on it till pretty late last night. That's right. He's you know what else you were doing boy. late last night? Yeah, he's biting boy. his lip. I have to go yeah. work on my speech. He should have been in the Sway Boys. <laughs> <laughs> he, he was the first. <laughs> I did not have sexual relations with that woman. Miss Lewinsky, I never told anybody to lie, not a single. They need to cut to more crowd reactions. Yeah. These allegations are false. No, they're not. But she sucks a mean one. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Why would you oh. clap? Who cares to clap? They're like, hell yeah. Nobody's like, uh, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I also just want to cut right to him being like, I want to apologize to the American people for getting my dick stuck. You know what I mean? Like, because four months later we found out. Wait, isn't that crazy? All these people, all this crowd, just for that response and then leaves. 30 seconds. Crushing. I mean, talk about viral. No content. That, 900 Numbers. million views. Numbers. Numbers. More than the Super Bowl. So, how old were you when you got in Sway? I was 17. Okay, so that was that kind of like your frat experience, essentially? Yeah, I would 100% compare that to my frat were you, you were in a relationship for a lot of it or no? Uh, I was on in a relationship, off. like, on and off, where I would say, like, yeah. a good majority of it. At least I mean, half. yeah, I lived in a frat house. I mean, probably some of the most fun you've ever had. Just, like, a bunch of your best friends. Hundreds. And it's just whatever. You just, What frat were you in? Delta Upsilon. I don't know that one. I don't know a it's lot. It's like a I don't triangle, know a then it looks like a Y. It was sick. It was, like, the epitome of, like, a normal frat house. Like, 50 guys lived in it. It had the pillars out front. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Greek awesome. letters and stuff. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, okay. 50 guys for real? Yeah, that's so. Because there was nice. er, there was a room for every letter of the alphabet, and every room had at least two people in it. Some wow. had four. Uh, Dude, so that's shits? more than fifty people. E, it might have been. Yeah, well, 20, if it's two it in every room, right? 40, uh, 26 times it was like 52. right around that. Twenty six times two is fifty two. Fifty two. Twenty six or twenty four letters in the alphabet. We'll be right back. How no, twenty six, right? Twenty six letters. Times I thought two. there was twenty six because you 52. said twenty six. I'm more of a math guy. Oh, I'm not shit. an alphabet guy. It's fi- yeah. Okay. Okay. Twenty six, right? Twenty six. Twenty six. Twenty four. Twenty four. Twenty six. It's twenty six. That's right. What yeah. the fuck? Yes. Okay. Did we Anyways, add more? We it's did. like you know when Hawaii <laughs> became a state. It's always been a state. Has it? Yes, you hate Hawaii. It's the best place in the world. You're an idiot. I don't think it's always been a state. It was its own place at one point. Because they had their own king and they Did had they get their acquired? own. acquired? I yeah. don't know if they would put it in the way of like acquired or like, you know, they got like kind of uh, stolen. I see what's you going know? on here. Like, well, Not, no, no, they just, we, people we, came in and kind of were like, this is us. No, no, no this place is tropical. How do you want to be Team USA? We, and then they show them that Bill Clinton video. <laughs> <laughs> Did we pay for it? I don't hey, think Who we gets the money? I think it was in a, Hawaii. like, I, that, I'm pretty sure Hawaii doesn't like love. No, they hate it. They no. hate no, because the, fat all the white states. mayonnaise Americans come there, eat their fucking pineapples, and trample over their like like sea turtles. We like fuck their culture up. Why? Oh, why yeah. would they like us? Yeah, of course. I mean, like you have people like Zuck that goes in and buys a bunch of their land, and yeah, then just that's... like you know what I mean. Like they kind of they're really great with people if they respect yeah. the island. Like if yes. you come in and you respect the island, you're a respectful person. They're going to bring you into their home and cook you a meal. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. But if you're someone that's going out there and you're being a dickhead, they'll make sure you get off the island. Like, yeah. fuck. That's true. Um, I love people from Hawaii. The Hawaii is the best place in the world. That's like, that's like my go-to. Like if I've been touring too much, I need to just like fuck mm. off for a little bit and reset. Hawaii's it's, great, Oh, man. it's incredible. The people are amazing. Incredible. The people, the people are fine. Hawaii's so fine. amazing. I went to I went, I went to the wrong place. <laughs> he, he went to like person. Cheesecake Factory. Though. He stayed in like downtown Honolulu. Well, you don't like Hawaii, the, do the you? most no, tourist no. place. <laughs> That'd be like go to LA. Yeah, like, Hawaii's fun. Whatever, Hawaiian people. That's no, not no, what no, it no, is. What I'm saying is, I I will I will readily admit I went to the wrong place. I've been to Hawaii one time. It was for shows. I went there.
there. What did I go? Honolulu. You stayed in downtown Honolulu. That'd Buddy. be like if you stayed on Hollywood Boulevard and be like, LA sucks. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, the whole experience was hanging out with Dora from Sunset Strip. I mean, literally, I stayed in a hotel that was across the street from a motherfucking cheesecake factory. What what is this? You didn't do Hawaii. You you just No, like, it sounds like you just went to the most touristy. You went place. to City Walk of Honolulu. Up. Guys, I messed up. I, let me take you. It's Wait, the best place in the world. Are you, yeah. are you inviting me? Sure. Let's go. Let's do it. I want to go. Podcast. I want to see Turtles back. No Great. straws. I love it. God damn. <laughs> <laughs> Who could it be now? <laughs> Who could it be now? <laughs> it's Blue Chew! Bitch! I got a big ass dick because of Blue Chew. And I'm sick of people not acting like I got a big ass dick. Yeah. <laughs> okay? <laughs> I got to pee from the free throw line because I'm so hard. That's what I'm saying to you, dude. It's got the same active ingredients as Viagra, Cialis, Levitra, a bunch of other bullshit. It's made in the USA. It's prepped, shipped here straight to your door in a discreet package. But it gives you not so much of a discreet package. Bigger cock. Dude, it, it looks... This is what I love about it. You don't gotta fucking time it out, okay? You take it whenever, and whenever the time arises yeah. for the sexual intercourse to happen, it's just ready to work. Okay? It's a chewable tablet. It's fucking awesome. Again, you don't gotta go to CVS or write it. Hey, excuse me, my dick doesn't work. No, it ships right to your door. Okay, it's so so easy, and everyone, you know, we say this all the time, but all these young dudes are like, I don't have a problem with round one. What about round two, you fucking steward <laughs> idiot? <laughs> So, Blue Chew wants to help you have better sex, dude. Discover your options at bluechew.com. Chew it and do it. Ooh, and, ooh. And, we, and we got a special deal for our listeners. Try Blue Chew free. That's right. Free. You freaking heard what I said. Free. When you use our promo code SOCKS at checkout, just pay $5 for shipping. Who cares about $5 for shipping, okay? That's bluechew.com promo code SOCKS to receive your first month free. Visit bluechew.com for more details and important safety information. And we thank Blue Chew for sponsoring this mother beeping podcast. God damn. So, that, just like that experience, how many was it? With five guys? Uh, it was a total a of, I think, seven. Seven. It was kind of like in and out. So, it's like it started off and it was me, Bryce, Griffin, Anthony, Jaden, Quentin, and Keo. So, yeah, seven. And then no one Blake. Everybody got had a chill name. name. Nobody's like, that's yeah. a shitty name. Yeah, everyone has a has an all right name. But I'm saying, like, for like a content house, like that checks oh, they all the were boxes. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. The yeah, most yeah. Like, I mean, content competing. house. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. like everybody in there sounds like it's like, yeah, that guy should be in a content. Hundred percent. And was the yeah. house paid for by like a bigger company? So what happened was I was starting a management company coming off of a tour we did that previous summer, and this was like before Sway Boys, but the tour we had went on had. Just like completely ripped all of us off. Oh, and really? like money and deals. We didn't like know what we were doing. We were all young. This was yeah, one of our like yeah, first yeah. experiences with social media. We're like 16, 17, right? Yeah. So then I was like, all right, social media is the Wild West. How can I like make a company by the creator for the creator where I know I don't want to rip off the creator? I am one of them. And yeah. I also like want to help all my friends out. So started a management company. You also we killed the queen. So, and then, yes, yeah, yeah. it's part of the plan. <laughs> um, <laughs> so went and, uh, yeah, started a management company and that's what kind of like repped the sway house. Mm, and oh, cool. so like, yeah, they were like repped all the boys and we signed like a hundred people off TikTok, And then I ended up selling my shares in that company. Um, after like kind of sway was done. But, yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. And you're well, very entrepreneurial. I think people don't understand that. The you have your hands in a lot of pots, I think. Well, right now he has his hand uh. Yeah. I'm crushing guys I'm doing stand up comedy Is right you still now. So the energy drink or no? No, uh, well, yeah, we just don't, like, I think it's something, like, I kind of step back from. There oh, was just okay. a couple people yeah. in certain businesses we were working on that I don't work alongside anymore and yeah. just for, you know, certain reasons and whatnot. So, like, there was just some stuff that I stepped away from. But. Dude, I know you get this question so many, but I'm, I'm fascinated. So, the, the house, like, what was that ecosystem like? Like, was it just, like, and don't answer if you don't want to. Was there just, like, vagina, like, it was, was it just, like, a vagina house? Um... The house wasn't shaped like a vagina. Yes. He's a, he's a media trained. Yeah, that's a, yeah, there that's we go. a, that's a good answer. answer. Yes. It was no, oh, uh, boy, yeah. <laughs> um, it was It was a crazy time. I mean, you could pretty much imagine, like, give seven, 17 to 19 year old, like, boys a uh, million, multi million dollar house and then unlimited, like, drinks and yeah. weed and drugs and, and women. And that's what that house was. It was a mess. It was like, Mattresses with no bed frames, you know what oh, I mean? Like, girls no, love for that. real? Oh, hundred yeah, percent. I'm pretty sure the first so like funny. six months of that house, I did not have a bed frame. I just had like a Casper mattress, which is like not a nice mattress. mattress. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah but yeah. it's like no bed frame. It yeah, was just yeah, like yeah. a sheet 
on a mattress on the ground. My buddy was across the room from me. He had a mattress on the ground. No like TV <laughs> in the room. Like porn stars, dude. Dude, it was like yeah, I, I walked like, in and be like oh, homeless people are here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it looked like we were like. Just like crash. Yeah, That's what's so yeah, funny yeah, about Los Angeles. They build these like six to ten million dollar mansions. They're gorgeous in the hills. Somebody develops it. They're like working on it for years. years. And then a bunch of just fucking kids run in. Like, We're gonna put my ring light, dog. <laughs> I think that's so funny. It's like yeah, so just many of these all open rooms with like a singular ring light. Yes, in it. exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And is what did, did people just like drive? Because I filmed at the hype house once, and there were people were just driving by like it was like a museum. They're like pointing out the window where people do that for you yeah, guys too. There was I remember a morning that me and Bryce went out to the, we had like a gym in our garage. So we wake up in the morning and go work out. And one morning we're out there and I go to lift the garage Holy like, shit. door open, you know, just cause fucking don't want to work out in like a hot yeah, closed yeah. garage, yeah, yeah. open it. And Hollywood fix is just sitting outside the garage no. door, like on our property too. Not like on the road. Yeah, like yeah. he is like at the garage door and it just opens up and the camera's up there. And it's like, good morning, Josh and Bryce. What's going on? And it's like, Oh my it's fucking chest day. That's dude. what's going on. What the fuck? Dude? Yeah. Isn't that like the most illegal thing that's ever, you can't go on someone's property, right? Like that's not, uh, you're pr I mean, yeah, I guess yeah, that's yeah. trespassing, right? But it's not like we were in a gated like area. Right. So we kind of just like walked up and I, I don't know, heard us in the garage. We Jesus opened Christ. it and just started. And we weren't going to be like, get the fuck out of yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah. we just ended up talking to the guy for like 10 minutes until he left. God damn. Yeah. Are you going to fight anybody? I don't think so. Okay. I don't think that's that's something that I want to go into. Okay. Yeah. I would just like to see it. Because I, I think I think you could fuck somebody up. Just based, I, just based on your energy. Okay. I feel like you're like, like just quick. Like, I think you're taller than a lot of people assume as well. I'll yeah, I, I'm six foot one. Yeah, got some, Me some too, wingspan. Bro. I got Me some too. reach. Yeah, yeah. I would need to train for a while, like a long time. <laughs> I want to give myself cauliflower ear just so people are scared. Cause they'd look at you and be like, "Yeah, dude, you see cauliflower oh, in front of me? Step in front of me. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Get your drink first, dude, man. It's, it's like having get a gun drink. on your face. Yeah, yeah. yeah People yeah, are just yeah. like, oh, this guy fights. Oh, hundred percent. But it's funny if, cause I think it's a majority of guys that know what it's from. A lot of girls are like, the Ew. fuck was he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that infected? Ew, it's, he looks like the Goonies. What's wrong with him? <laughs> You're like, I fight people. <laughs> it is funny because it's just like everything you do just, just steers more towards men. The reason you work out, guys ask you questions. You get cauliflower ear, guys ask you more questions. No girls like, oh, cool. Well, I yeah. feel like girls say they don't like dress for guys either. You know? Oh, that's true. You know what I'm saying? No. It's like the same thing, I think. Yeah. It's like guys. It's all for the same. You do it for guys a lot of the time. Guys are for guys. Like, yeah. I feel like yeah. you hearing like a compliment from a girl being like, yo, dude, you look big. Versus like one of your boys come up to you and being like, hey, man. I've been seeing you hit in the gym, looking good. It's just yeah. like a little more like, yeah, ah, yeah. that's, that's, that's genuine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's emotions. genuine. Yeah yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I'd way rather have a compliment well, from Well, it's like, that's why every yeah. guy in the world has a loud car because they want the validation, but they only really get it from other men. That's the only people I'm looking to get validation for my car from. Oh, though. really? You know what I'm saying? I don't know if I want, like, I don't need a girl to come up and, like, know more about a car than me. That's intimidating. Oh, that's now. <laughs> no, I'm that's an idiot. Funny. You know what is I'm this saying? I don't even know. I don't know what this is. Are you a big car guy or what do you have? Um, no, I'm not, like, a big car guy. Uh, I, I have a Tesla. Nice. So it's just, you know, it's great. L.A. Same. Don't drive a lot. Yeah, it's yeah. The best time. I bought it, like, just before the gas prices started going crazy, oh, too. So it was, like, the perfect time. Yeah, all my yeah, friends yeah. Were like, fuck this bullshit. Like, I'm paying all this money for gas. And I'm yeah. sitting there like... $17, 350 miles. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, it's like, it's awesome. So that part was awesome. But I had an E63S before that Mercedes. That was great. That I loved. It was yeah, so that was like clean. sick. All right, guys, it's time. Sock Talk, Secret Sock. <laughs> um, we had some audience submissions. Um, we had a question specifically for the three of you um, in honor of Josh being here. Sweet. This comes from Allie, and she says, for guys who were in the streets and are now in relationships, yep. uh, how do I get a guy like that? Like, what made you want to commit to your girl now mm. as opposed to the other girls before? That's a good question. This is a great question. You guys were in the streets? Oh, yeah. Dabbled. You, I was, you I was dabbling in the streets? I was in the 101, the 405. This, this guy That's was. Dirty. 95 yeah. North and South. This guy might have been in the hiking trails. I don't even know if these were paved. I mean, he they was weren't. off-roading. He was going to underdeveloped roads. Yes. Oh, <laughs> he was dude, making his crazy. own roads. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was yeah, going yeah, underneath style. the roads. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, I was crazy. going to tunnels, the Jewish ones. Guys, I was going everywhere. Yeah, you were you were deep in there. Yeah, it wasn't great. And how long have you been in a relationship for now? Five, six, seven months, something like that. I thought you were about to say years. No, no, no. Jeez, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. you're married. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Um, yeah, I mean, you want I, you you want to take it? Sure. Yeah. I mean, for me, I think what happened that made me like want to get out of the streets, I guess, was it was the way that Gabby really went about keeping me guessing. 
right? Like it was the first girl in a long time that wasn't just like, oh yeah, I'll kiss you on the first night or yeah, yeah I'll come back to your house on the first night or we'll be in bed together by the end. Of the first. She was like, no, you're going to have to like work for this. Like yeah. I know who you are and I know like kind of your rep, like this isn't going to be something that just happens. And there was probably, we probably went out eight, 10 times before like, I mean, like I even got to kiss this girl. Yeah. Like it was like, I had to put work in, but that just like, that was like, the, yeah, of course. that's the game. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Like, yeah, it's yeah. like the game's back and like, that's fun. Like that's you're fun. in the chase. Like, yeah, they like touch your hand on date five and you're, you're like, like, oh my God, shit, dude. No. <laughs> yeah, like, you turn back to like your middle school again. Oh, well, the first day that she, cause I had gone so in my head. Cause the first night I tried to lean in and make, start like kissing her, making out with her or whatever. And she swerved me. Yeah. And like, wow. I was like, this is, this is, I've never been served in my life before. What yeah, the fuck is this? Like, <laughs> you know what I'm Whoa, I'm like, <laughs> yeah. So I was like, what the fuck? So I'm not, I'm not leaning in again. I'm like, I'm waiting now. Yeah. Like, for the rest yeah, of this, yeah, yeah. I, she's going to, cause like, I don't want Seven wanna... dates, you're not even looking at each yeah, other. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. then the one day she, she, and she sleeps at my house one night. Don't even. Nothing. She's sleeping in the same bed with me, and I'm just nervous. Yeah. And the next morning we wake up. Pillow between you. Yeah, for real. Like, kind of got like something in the middle. Mittens on your hands. Like, (laughs) no. Got oven (laughs) mittens. And uh, she ends up like her friends are in the house too. They're in a different room. They're like, okay, we're gonna go. And she's like, they're like the Uber And She's like, okay, give me like five minutes. And she like turns and looks at me. She's like, so. And I was like. So it sounds like the Uber service should like go down, just yeah. totally missing cues. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. <laughs> and you start down, overthinking shit. Yeah, I started overthinking. Go downstairs, open the door first. She kind of like waits a moment and walks out, and I like start walking out with her. And eventually, she just turns around and like grabs my face oh, and starts like kissing oh, me. Moment. And then I was like, like I was, I was stunned. I was, yeah. I was like giddy like a schoolboy. I think yeah, I yeah. skipped yeah. back inside after <laughs> yeah, she left, dude. Kiss her, girl frolic back inside. I was just started jump roping in the backyard. I had to catch myself. I was like, whoa, hey, hey. Yeah. yeah, shut the fuck up. I'm six one. <laughs> right, so let's hit the fucking garage gym now. <laughs> yeah, but that's a great feeling, and it's like you build up to it, and then you have that like tension. It finally happens. Yeah, and like, before you you notice it, you're like, oh, I've been fully locked in like oh. on this woman's emotions this whole time. Yep, hundred percent. That's beautiful. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I so with me, this is gonna sound so corny, dude, but like, I, I'm gonna just say it. I literally have never been, uh, I've never felt like that, like, love on first sight mm. thing, mm. ever. What about me? Oh, well, you for sure. Cool. When we met, I was just like, dude. But that's like, that's gay love. Yeah, that's gay yeah. love. That's, that's like Everyone that's like, knows that's love at first sight. Yeah, that's love. a thing. That's it, boys. Yeah. yeah, I mean, when you, isn't that funny? When you do meet a boy, you're like, are we friends already? It you feels good. Know. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know pretty instantly yeah, yeah. that you're going to be boys. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Take pretty 30 cool. minutes. It's pretty cool. It We're cool. about dogs at a dog park. Be like, hey, that was funny. Hey, man, dap me up. Yeah, oh, sniff right, a little yeah. ass. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, we, we're we tight. <laughs> we're tight. What are, you, uh, what are you doing Friday, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the, fir- the first text to see if you guys are hanging out as boys, you go, I Like, it feels like, you're yeah, like, oh, yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, that was that was me and my, and my girl right now. Like, I Like, the first date. We, she was like, I was late because I was stupid. And I like entered and I was like, I was texting her, like, hey, I'm here. Where you at? She's like, right behind you. I turn around. And it was like the obviously the first time I like saw her in person because we met on like Raya. And I turned around and I had this like, obviously she's beautiful, but it was like way more than that. It was so mm. weird. It's like, just like my body like flooded with endorphins. Did you and like I was, freeze for a second, like slow mo. Like, yeah, I yeah, swear to like God, dude. Scene. Yeah, it was like there was like wind, her hair was moving. I was like, we're inside, what's happening? And, <laughs> and, and we just started talking and like, just immediate, just like chemistry, super funny, and just like we we're like riffing off top. Yeah. And it was like laughing immediately. She was laughing immediately. And it was just like it was yeah, good banter. It, it, dude, the banter was crazy. And we key, huge. Key. Key. And the the first date was like I think almost five hours. And we were just literally Whoa. just at like at a table, just talking, laughing, drinking, whatever. And somebody and, definitely got a parking ticket. That's crazy. Oh, yeah. But 100%. I would have but five hours. I, dog, almost getting towed at that. I, I would have taken that. I would have taken an impoundment car. <laughs> Take it. Yeah, who cares? Uh, sure, your car's on I fire. I found love. Cool. Something yeah, much yeah, better. I don't need that fucking Take car. my car. I got don't something care. much better. Yeah. So you're saying I love you to this girl? Yeah. Oh, then? Right at no, 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 no. Like now. Oh, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, but yeah, Drop I think that. hard eye. That's crazy. Oof. But uh, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that like kind of helps this lady's present situation. But like, that's what it was for me. It was just like this, in, I've, and I've never felt it before. And I was just like, I, I was just like infatuated. Like not in not in a negative way. Just like uh, uh, just an infatuated in the most positive way. Is infatuated a negative? It could be if you're like. Infatuated. I thought it was a food app. Infatuation, <laughs> isn't it? 
I don't know about that. Man, fuck you, it is. <laughs> infatuation. I thought infatuation was like, you're like obsessed with it. Yeah, but what I'm saying, but obsessed can have a, obsessed can have a native conversation ah, I guess too. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah. Infatuation. In, in the bushes and be like, what is she doing? Oh, okay, like, you yeah, know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. Like that. Is it really one? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's like they oh, like okay. rate like food in LA or really any big city. Oh, cool. Mm-hmm. I so what know. was her question? Her question is like, how do I get that? Yeah, just like, how yeah. do you, she wants a dude that's like, she wants to be the guy or the girl that a guy is like, I'm giving it all up for you. You know what I mean? You just got to make them like, it's like a slow roll. Yeah. You got to play the game. You got to play the game. And then if he backs off too soon, he wasn't the guy. No. Yeah. Yeah. I think, I think the slow, the slow pay is definitely key, but it's also just like, this sounds so corny, but it's also like kissing as not as many frogs. It sounds like you're out here fucking, fucking whoever. But I think it's just like giving yourself enough chances and eventually you will find the right person. It's just like, and not put it in the forefront of your brain to be like, okay, this has to be the, the person. Night. Yeah. yeah, yeah just yeah. go out there and just like kind of be easy, breezy Feel with it. Out. And you'll eventually, you will eventually meet someone that like you connect on a, like a crazy level that you'd never thought you could connect with someone like that. So I think the f- slow play and just like giving yourself enough options, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Great. Cool. Great advice, guys. Um, let's uh, make a hard right turn. This is a Secret Sock anonymous submission. This isn't a question. They just wanted to uh, give you guys uh, a life pro tip. Yep. Good. They said, uh, I got a blowjob after we got Indian food together. There was still some residual spice in her mouth from the meal. I've never felt pain like that in my life. Absolutely horrible. I thought I was going to die. Oh, no kidding. No. Could have gone one of two ways. Could be like a fire and ice condom type thing. Yeah. Mm. Uh, there's still some spice in the mouth. Um, I got jerked off with with someone with um, what is it? The what are the what are the things to eat? The Cheetos, Zins? spicy Cheetos, <laughs> oh, hot Cheetos. Thank yeah, you, yeah, hot yeah. What girl was eating hot Cheetos and jerked off? She was off? from the Bronx, bro. <laughs> Wait, this is real? <laughs> that yes. Is this is street days. This is oh, this is <laughs> this street is, days. Yeah, yeah street yeah, yeah, urchin yeah, yeah, Mike. Yeah. They used to call me. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> going dude, you're in the median right now. You're <laughs> like the most <laughs> central street land. A girl ate hot Cheetos and jerked you hot off. Hot Cheetos in the Bronx. She wasn't even just separate handed in it. Like yeah, we were. We were no, no, we were both eating, and then we like got we got into it, and like Crazy. nobody was wiping whatever. But hot Cheetos, like if you eat enough, dude, it's they in your in your oh, it's embedded. Yeah. It's yeah, embedded yeah, yeah, yeah. in the yeah, fingerprints. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Had a tattoo. Yeah, <laughs> I'm pretty sure they change your fingerprints forever. They yes. do. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, the so, queen. but uh, but yeah, well, I was jerked up. But that, that's my only like relation to this thing. I mean, dude, I don't know. It's you know, may, but maybe it might make you come quicker. Like you get two different sensations. He said it was bad, but maybe if you get a little bit of tingle. I think a little You're bit out. of tingles. Josh, I'm, out. So out. I'm so out. A little bit of tingles good, but too much tingles. I, I thought that story was going to go in a way different direction, but I thought what was, direction do you think? I thought he was going to like be like, "This is not sitting well on my stomach." Mid blowjob, he um shit. Yeah. Oh, I've never. I don't had, think you could. No, that's what I'm saying. Right? I, it's it's same well, thing as like when you're hard and you try to pee, like you kind of can't, can't pee. Yeah, I feel yeah, like you yeah, can't yeah. shit when you're. I've had the I bubble so. guts. Can't a strong mid-fuck. word. Yeah, I hear you. I've had the bubble guts mid fuck before, but, but you I've hear never these stories. What's up? You hear these stories like somebody lets out like a little bit of a fart, either yeah, with a getting down on or yeah, down. yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think yeah. it's impossible, but I just didn't know where that story was going. Mm. That's always the worst ever. Is when you're like, yo, I need to like, and it's not going to be an okay poop. Like it's going to be a nightmare, and you're at like her place, and the bathroom is next to her bed, and you're like, what do I do now? Pull the fire alarm? I think you I, how do it. I? What's up? I think you just own it. You, you own, own it? it? You gotta own it. Dude, my... Yeah, that's a power move. That's my cool. two ex kind of just like asserts your dominance. Yeah. It's like a dog. Yeah. Yeah, but what if... It's not fucking throw What if it's date one? Yeah. It's you know what I mean? Like, bro. it's... I'm fighting demons. I'm holding back. People be shit. People nah, be shit. But you, but you know what I mean, though. That's not, what you have to say when you walk in, yo. People, people be, be shit. But I'm, ta- <laughs> I'm talking about, like, after, like, Indian... Like, after, like, a... Like it's not okay. Right, right, like right. It's right. Like a right. I think you maybe just let her go to the bathroom first, and then you go after because she won't be in the bathroom for uh, a while. You know what I'm saying? You ask she, her, do you need to go to the bathroom? Real quick? <laughs> I think you do. Like, what? You're Yo, my girlfriend. So my girlfriend does that. Not really? like with the bathroom, but like where she'll suggest something that I want to do, mm. but she's just planting ideas in my head, and she thinks I don't like real. Like she'll be yeah, like, yeah, yeah. she'll be like, it will be in bed, and it'll be like nighttime, and she'll be like, don't you think you like probably want to go brush your teeth now and like put on like maybe like cologne or whatever because like I want to like kiss you and like y- you don't want to kiss me like I think you probably want to go brush your teeth and I'm like eating a bag of chips and I'm like what the fuck smart. yeah sure just that's ask smart. me to go do this yeah, yeah, yeah. like put my shit away that's smart um, apparently it's a really popular thing not really popular but a lot of people are into the idea of um, fire into and it. ice blowjobs and they'll do they'll fill two cups with different temperature liquids so like a cold water with ice cubes <gasps> and then a hot mint tea Hey. And then do 
Wait. Hand jobs and blow jobs with the tea like in the mouth. Oh, this is great. Wait, oh. wait there's an ice cube and hot tea in the mouth? So yeah, you have a, a cup of cold water and then a cup of hot tea. And so like you'll take a swig of the cold water with ice cubes, start going down on a guy. And then take a oh. swig of the black the Oh, mint it's like tea. when you'd make those wax hands in the back in the day at the carnival. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Nobody? You didn't no, make no, those? I, said, no, I yeah, get what you're saying. I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. The, dude, I haven't got an ice cube blowjob in seven years. Almost as good as the ice cube in the bong back in the day. Oh. When you rip a bong what? with the ice cube in it. And it was just like a little bit cool. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. 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 Like, yeah. It, so it just makes it like head. less harsh. Yeah. And but the like, smoke tasted clean, like yeah. cleaner almost. It was cleaner, like I'm hitting a bong from like Antarctica. I I was, yeah, I thought <laughs> I was fucking Captain Planet over yeah, there, dude. Yeah, dude. I felt like a, like an explorer oh, or something. Yeah. Like, it just soothed and you're like, this is helping my lungs. I think it was worse for your lungs, honestly. It was. Well, because you could take more smoke. liquid in it. Yeah, I mean, dude, but those bongs like water the bong, vapor? Yeah, yeah. Lungs. I don't I think it was great for the <laughs> oh, The bong hits with no ice. Those coughs, you're like, am I going to die? Have you ever accidentally hit a bong with no water? Yes. No, <laughs> I have not. It, it, it's just a, It's the, like, someone just, like, goes and empties the bong and leaves oh, it. So this happened no. to me one time. Someone just had, like, left it out, and they had emptied it. Dude, it's hard. I go over and I pack it. You try to hit one of those, you're dead. Yeah. Oh, no. Well, it's like those, uh, the ones that you, they used to be. Outer used to be, like, body experience. But you ever hit one of those, like, shotgun pipes? ones? Where it's like just the, like it has the, the on the, the back, it's just like you just... Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, what are those called? It literally looked like a fucking pickle or a cucumber. Shotgun pipe, I think? Yeah, and you press it, right? right yeah, yeah, and then you to clear it, you just move your hand off. It's essentially like that, but so harsh. I've never even heard of that shotgun I forget thing. what it, it was. It, it is called a shotgun pipe. I'll yeah, it was literally right. just like a bong without the water. Or like uh, the they're, they're, oh, like, yeah, like, like, yeah. like, like that, yeah. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. This was like... Early, early, uh, like okay, okay, okay. Before bongs were really like super, super sick. Those yeah, so I remember bad. when people were big into the pipes. I'm yeah, like, oh, I yeah. feel like when I first started smoking, everyone and because it was so easy, I think. Yeah, that you know, you're like hiding it from your parents. Still, yeah, it's like yeah. you have this tiny little pipe you can put in, in that drawstring bag that everyone would yeah. have. Dude, we used to have the uh, the, the gravity <laughs> bongs out of the two liter. Yeah, like, cut the oh, just because you can bathtub. make them in anyone's house. Yes. Parents are not don't make that anywhere. They go into the garage and just. We would put a sock in the bottom of a bottle, fill the whole thing up with water, and then you drain it out. Yeah, and then it would essentially take the hit for you, take the top of, and then you hit it. Oh, and one of those. So you put a pen cap or a socket in the top part. All this is filled with water. Yeah. Weed is full. And, you like and, then cut when holes, you, like, and then when you start draining the water, that's sucking the oh, weed into the I bottle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then when you, so it pretty yep. much like, I think, <clears throat> smokes a whole bowl is in one Got water it. bottle. Got it. it completely ashes it. And then you hit just that oh, one high and you're fuck, bro. in yeah, Pluto. You're, you're like <laughs> another level. Yeah, it is. An, it, it's a crazy one. It's but fun. One. It fun. Is fun. A lot more fun than um, hitting a waterless bong. I know that's trash. What are we doing that for? Um, um, Josh Richards, buddy. I mean, check out his sketch show. You were in a movie with Nicolas Cage. I don't even think we talked about that. Were you in the scene with him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's fucking awesome. It was so cool. He man. seems so cool, man. Yeah, was super he, like down yeah. to earth. You yeah. know, like just like chill guy. At least that was my experience with him. Like, yeah, yeah. like chill. Were you nervous acting alongside with him, or you're like, I'm just gonna do my shit? And um, I was, I was nervous. I would say, but I think it was kind of a mentality of you know, I have one scene with Nicolas Cage and I have uh, another scene later in the film, like, let's make sure this fucking yeah, kills, you yeah. know? Like, let's go into this and just, like, have fun. And I'd hung out with Noah Centineo, like, the whole two days oh, prior cool, to yeah. Toronto. So, like, that was the three people in the scene. So I was pretty comfortable with Noah. And, and how did that come about? Did you audition for it? Do you get kind of, like, some of these are just, like, a text, like, hey, we love your stuff. Do you want to be in this? Or yeah, was this I, was, whole I was just, like, asked to go in it. I didn't audition hmm. or anything oh, like that's that. Oh, cool. So, yeah. Do you want to get into that like more like legit type of stuff? Or are you like yeah, angling I think towards that? That's yeah. that's cool. definitely a place I want to go into. I mean, I think with this comedy sketch show, that's kind of like I get to test out some stuff. Yeah, and, you yeah, know, like great. get my feet wet. Well, also the best characters. because you're in control of it, so it's like you're not like memorizing somebody else's lines. It's like this is the stuff you wrote, the stuff that you think is funny, so it's easy. You can do your best acting in these sketches. Yeah, 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 yeah. and I think it just gets the reps, you know. Yeah, yeah. it's good to get 100%. those reps. We'll that's check out sick. the sketch show, uh, Josh Richards. Thank you so much for coming on, man. I really appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, this is so episode. fun, dude. Thank you so and much. I can't for believe you killed the queen. It's gotta do what bro. you gotta do. Wow, great ending. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, thank you so much, man. That's it. We love you guys. Till next Wednesday, big old dick.